Hello and welcome back. In today's video, we'll find about the working of LM317 Variable Adjustable Voltage Regulator, about its circuit and use and how you can easily make it. First of all, we'll know about LM31 device. It is adjustable 3 terminal positive voltage regulator and is capable of supplying more than 1.5 amps within a voltage range of 1.25 volts to 37 volts or up to 40 volts. It consists of three pins. First one is adjust, second V out, third V in. V out and V in is connected to the resistors, normally to 20 ohms or a little above, and other resistor acts as a potentiometer for giving desired DC supply voltage depending upon the resistor value with recommended starting value from 1 to 10k but higher resistance will lower the voltage supply for lower voltage DC supply from 5 to 12 volts potentiometer value up to 10k it will be sufficient and a fixed stabilized voltage settings can be applied as per our requirement LM317 IC is also known as linear voltage regulator as it can generate a lot of heat Therefore, heat sinks are required for high current applications. One disadvantage is that there is some little voltage drop across the regulator lost as heat. Here is a simple circuit with least requirement which you can try. You can experiment with more than 220 ohms up to 1k and see the difference in the output. Furthermore, you can calculate the voltage output depending upon the resistor values of R1 and R2. By using this given formula for calculation, here 1.25 is the starting range for output voltage as per LM317 regulator. After giving these resistor values, we can determine the output voltage we can get. Similarly, resistor value can also be determined when the output voltage is given. First of all, testing this simple circuit on a breadboard. This is LM317 regulator, 220 ohms resistor, a 10k port. Now setting it on the breadboard as per the circuit diagram. Making connections after inserting 10k potentiometer. Connecting one of the terminal to the ground, which is negative input. Connecting wire to V input terminal. And other red wire to V output. Another black wire is connected to the ground, which is V output. Looking closer, you can see connections more clearly. After connections are done, we can start checking the voltage output by rotating the center wiper terminal with the help of screwdriver, clock or anti-clockwise for reducing or increasing voltage or giving any fixed voltage value. Here I am getting total voltage up to 4.88 volts and input supply voltage is 5.75 volts. I can also set the fixed voltage supply here. Testing with 3 volt LED with terminals connected to output voltage. For further use, you can create the module using this circuit. You can use a circuit board or a piece of cardboard. After making connections, we can see it's working. Hope you found this video tutorial helpful and knowledgeable. Then do like, share, comment and subscribe.